What's going on guys? you hanging with Hardy Tech and welcome back, or not welcome back, welcome to Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke Run, and we're not moving yet. I skipped the stupid intro part because the intros are very, very boring, and um, yeah, so today we're going to be starting Pokemon Platinum Randomizer, and before we get started, I want to say something because I know everybody is going to be freaking asking, how do you play Randomizer Platinum? Because I know for like Heart Gold and Soul Silver, or... Yeah, that's the name of the games. Uh, there's like an AR code that you use and you put in. This is not a code. It is like a program, not like the Emerald program. That was like didn't work for a lot of people. This is a, it's um I guess it's an extension for a uh, Desmume. It only works with um Desmume. I don't believe it works with No Cash GBA, which means I have to use Desmume for this. But the good news is, uh, I can now switch to screens. Yay! <laughs> I don't know why that came up, but. And there will be a link, Hope, if I remember, it'll be a link in all the Platinum videos, but I know at least in this one, there will be a link, and it'll take you to a video from a friend of mine, which is Sean T. Rods 91 he, he didn't make it, he modified it, and you can download it from there, it shows you how, he shows you how to use it and everything, so go show him a lot of support, because he's a great Pokemon director, he's a Pokemon, or, yeah, I think he's still a Pokemon Unite director, I don't remember, <laughs> bad memory, and uh, he should be. Probably. Okay, anyways, yeah, go click the link in the description. You can download it there. He'll show you how to play it. And if you have any questions about it, make sure to ask him. So that's how you play Platinum in the video below. All right, so the first thing we got to do is take a step, and our enemy, our rival, will come in. Here we go. Oh, look, as if on cue. Mustard, there you are. You might be wondering about his name. No, it is not because of his hair color. I'll get to it in a second. Hey, Ketchup, did you see the TV? Okay, you might be wondering about my name. Once again, I'll get to that in a second. Did you see the TV? Sure you did. Professor Rowan's that really important guy who studies Pokemon, right? That means he must have lots and lots of Pokemans. So if we ask him, I'd bet he'd give us some Pokemon. Exclamation point. Oh, hey, is this a new PC? Hey, hey, will you pay attention? We're kind of in the middle of a conversation here. Oh, right, right. We're going to see Professor Rowan and get some Pokemon. I'll be waiting outside. Okay, Ketchup, if you're late, I'm finding you 10 million Poke Dollars. Alright, so, to describe the names, no, I actually just realized this, that our hat is red and his hair is yellow, so ketchup and mustard kind of makes sense there, but that is actually not how I came up with the names at all. If, for ketchup, if you guys are friend, if any of you are friends with me on Steam, you'll know how I came up with the name ketchup, and, um, yeah. <laughs> uh, if you don't, if you don't, if you're not friends with me on Steam, then I guess it's kind of an inside joke to the people who are, so, yay. And mustard, you know, I love ketchup. I don't like mustard. I don't like my rival. So my rival is now mustard. See how it works? That's pretty much how I came up with that. So we got to go over to our rival's house. And one thing bad about Desmume is that I can't use um, point. I normally I was gonna use uh, 0 0.9.9 .9 since it runs really fast and it's just like magnificent stuff. But you can't do that with the randomizer. So I had to use 0 0.9.8, .9, which for me it lags you know it, it like you can probably tell like, right now the music slowed down like the actual in-game doesn't really seem to lag that much it's just the audio lags it's like slower than it should be and it's annoying it's so annoying so um, if you guys are uh, gonna, if you're gonna be using a randomizer you can't use 0 0.9.9 .9. you have to use 0 0.9.8 .9, which is a bummer but he uh, includes in the download I believe he includes a copy of Desmume so you don't have to go hunt that down or anything and it comes with everything you need to play so you can have a big old happy smile happy face on your face or wherever you choose to put your happy faces if you like to put your happy faces on your thumb put your happy face on your thumb if you like to put it on your arm put it on your arm if you like to put your faces on your butt then put your, put your faces on your butt simple as that what? Don't go into the grass? No worries, no problem. It doesn't matter what, we don't have any Pokemon. Trust me on this one, I've got an idea. Now listen, you know how wild Pokemon jump at you when you go in tall grass? So, what do you do is you scoot over to the next patch of grass before- Okay, I've tried this before. It does not work. I've like been in one patch, I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna step into the next one. And the second I even step in there, Pokemon's like, ooh, dinner time, baby. And then I get eaten, which... It's very unfortunate. So, try and just to run through the grass, you, you stupid mustard. It does not work. So, don't even try it. Oh, look, here comes an old dude. You two don't seem to have any Pokemans yet. Then, what is the meaning of going into the tall grass? I don't know how to say dots, so I'm just gonna say dots. Oh, God. Why, why, 
What is what is going on here? Hey, catch up, this old guy. It's Professor Rowan, isn't it? What's he doing here? Oh, is it? Hey, hey, aren't we trying to talk here? And you just walk away as if we like not. We're not even here. You just you completely ignore us. That's not cool. Get back here. Thank you. You two, you truly love Pokemon, do you? Ah, eh, not really. Whoa, hold up. You're not making any sense here. Ahem. I didn't quite catch that, so I'll ask again. You two truly love Pokemon, do you? Alright, yeah, whatever. Me too, I love Pokemon. I'll ask you once again, you two truly... This is the third time you asked us. I mean, I, I said no the first time, I said yes the second time. Obviously, I can't really make up my mind, but still, you, you'd think you'd at least, you know, take the second answer and just roll with it, you know, be happy. Uh-huh, well, I, uh, well, then forget about me. Just give a Pokemon a friend, friend here. I mean, it was me who tried to go into... See, now, Mustard's being a decent person. He's saying I should get the Pokemon. I I appreciate that. However, you must promise me that you'll never be recklessly endanger yourselves again. Now then, now where? Oh, good. The old guy lost his briefcase. Typical old guy... Oh, hey, Don. Hello. You left your briefcase at the lake. Oh, is that so? Is something wrong here? Aha, uh -huh, there it is. Nice work, Don. What I was about to do is entrust these two with their own Pokemon. Oh, pardon? These Pokemon are hard to replace. Are you sure about giving them away? Mm-hmm. We exist side by side with Pokemon. There comes a time when people should meet Pokemon. Uh, why am I- I don't like talking and yet here I am reading all the dialogue. Well, obviously not all of it because I've skipped like three quarters of it. Just talking about something else, but, you know. Alright, so... It's time to pick our Pokemon. What are we gonna pick? We have. I was waiting for it. To, I was waiting for it to close. We have, in this briefcase, Turtwig. In this briefcase, Chimchar. And in this, not briefcase. In this Pokeball, Piplup. So who's gonna be? There's a lot of votes for each, but in the end, it came down to. Da -da -da. It came down to the return of Mountain Dew. That's right, guys. It is going to be Turtwig. I actually really wanted to go with Chimchar at first because he's the Chimchar line's the only one I haven't had yet. So I thought it would have been awesome. You know, I had both uh, Turtwig and Pipwop line of Spirit Gold. So having the Chimchar line would have been awesome. But everyone's like, bring back Mountain Dew. Yeah. So I, I really had no choice but to do that. And now the Oak and Don, or not Oak, the Oak wannabe and Don are just are just gonna walk right by. Please let me pass. I'm sorry, was I blocking your path or something? Cause I was not standing in a way and you're just, you're just stupid. You're just, you're just stupid. That's all you are. Oh great, he's got an idea. Hey, hey, catch up, we both got Pokemon now. There's only one thing to do, right? Are you ready for this? Yeah, I am. Always wanted to say this. This time is finally to come. Catch up. I challenge you to a battle. Whoever, who grows up thinking I'm gonna battle ketchup someday? I just, I despise ketchup so much. I'm gonna grow up and I'm just gonna pour mustard all over it on horseradish and mayonnaise. I'm gonna demolish that ketchup. That is a very disturbing thing to say. All right, so we know water type move. Unfortunately, it only raises our defense. So that's unfortunate. But he's going to go for the Leer, which um not incredibly happy about. But as long as he doesn't attack me, like if he just does nothing but Leers, I can't really complain that much because that would be, you know, fantastic. And we're going to go for another tackle and his Chimchar is not going to know what hit him. And I kind of wish I would have got the potion out of my PC because I have a feeling that's going to be useful because three more scratches... And we're gonna be dead. And I think it's he has like three more tackles, and then he's gonna die. So it, it'd be nice if he like goes for another weird, or if we get a crit, that'd be fantastic. <gasps> I think one more tackle is gonna do it. Please don't get a crit. Oh, he went for weird. He's handing us the victory. I, you guys would probably say, oh, it's impossible to lose this. I have lost this before. I was when I played. I'm playing. Well, I was playing Platinum on my DS. I'm not anymore. But I played Platinum on my DS a while ago. I picked Piplup. And uh, he had Turtwig, and all he did was withdraw, so I was doing 1 HP, a tackle, and then he just started tackling me and just destroyed me. Or, no, I think Pip-Up gets Pound, but same thing. But, it, yeah, it was it was a nightmare. I did not enjoy that at all. 
Wait, wait, let's get home. I best I'm beat after battling you. My Pokemon needs rest. See you, catch up. Yeah, see ya. Alright. Time to go home, apparently. Just that was it for today, I guess. Hey mom. Mom, mom, hey, hey, wait, wait, hey, get back here. Thank you. What's the matter, dear? That, that, how, what are, how am I supposed to speak dots? It just doesn't make sense. You mustard are lucky to have met Professor Rowan. Imagine if you didn't. I wouldn't like to think what the wild Pokemon might have done to you two. Catch up, go see Professor Rowan and thank him properly for your Pokemon. His land, his lab is in Sand Gym Town. Now that you've got your own Pokemon, tall grass won't be so threatening. Oh, I know, catch up, put these on. Ketchup received a pair of running shoes. Yeah. Going to San Gym. Oh, God. I'm so glad we had running shoes. I despise walking so much. It's torturous. Why am I still talking to you? Press the B button and dash about faster than ever before. Put on the running shoes and... Well, isn't that just nifty? It is nifty. All right. Well, before we go anywhere else, let's um, change the options up a bit. Let's put button mode. No, I want text speed. That's what I want to change. And for frame, let's change up the frame. Let's let's use. I always like this frame. That, that frame always looked awesome, in my opinion. All right, let's get out of this place. We apparently don't need to be here anymore. And now we can run. It's still pretty slow due to the lag, but you know what? It, it's running either way. Oh God, there's mustard again. Just getting all up in this place, ruining, ruining our fun. You know that lake we always play at? You know how they say there's legendary Pokemon there? You guessed it! Let's catch that Pokemon. That'll make Professor Rowan happy. I'm sure of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You and me together. We. I can't tell you how much. I just want to skip this part right now because I despise the beginning of the beginning of Platinum. It's just so slow because it takes forever, and it just I I don't like it very much. But you know, apparently there's nothing I can do about that. All right, we're at the lake. Get ready because we're capturing that legendary Pokemon. Spoiler alert, we don't. Sorry if I just ruined that for anybody. My bad. What's going on? Does he see a guy standing there and you just assume something's going on? Is he not allowed to just stand there? Because last time I checked, we're just standing here and no one's walking up to us accusing us of doing something. They're just like, oh hey, it's a person. Cool. I'm fine with people. You know, he said please, so I guess we can let him walk by us. That was a nice one. What was that all about? Weird a weird guy. He was just standing there. Who are you to judge him? You have no right to judge that guy. You are a, a horrible person. So, just, you should be very upset. Did you hear that, Ketchup? That was the legendary Pokemon crying. That had to be it. Okay, this is our chance. Wait, we don't even have any Pokeballs. Are we supposed to get... Oh! We don't have... Oh, yeah, I just, I just said that. Hey, I just told you we don't have any Pokeballs. Do you think Professor Rowan give us some if we asked him? We do have money. We could just buy them, you know. I mean, first one of Professor Oaks, Pro Professor Lab and Sandgem Town Rose. Uh, this is why I don't read. I can't freaking read. All right, so we are now on Verity, Verity, Verity Lakefront, and uh, on Route 201, we gotta hope we don't run into any Pokemon. Cause, all right, before we step into this tall grass, there's like a long roll of people always arguing about this. When does a Nuzlocke run start? Well, 99, well, 98 percent of time for me, it starts as soon as you begin the game. In Fire Red Omega, I did it after I got Pokeball. So once again, I'm going back to it starts right freaking now. So if I run into a Pokemon here on Route 201 before I get any Pokeballs, that route's dead for me. Can't get anything else there. Rest of the game, never, ever, ever. So I kind of hope we don't run into wild Pokemon, but I kind of do just to show that like, hey, this is freaking random. We can get like an Onix right now. So um, yeah, let's. Let's step into the wild grass, and I'm not gonna wa I'm not gonna run just because I wanna. I think um, walking like decreases the chances of someone showing up. And all right, all right, we're almost there. We're almost there. We can do this. One more, one more. Oh, we made it! Yeah, victory! All right, we made it to San Jim Town, and there's Don being all, being all Don-like. Oh, there you are. Come with me. The professor is waiting. I'm sure he is, Don. I'm sure he is. This is it, our Pokemon Research Laboratory. Let's go! Oh, look who it is. It, it's, the, it's the annoying guy. Oh, it's you, Ketchup. That old guy, he's not so scary so much as he totally is out there. Oh, it doesn't matter. Uh, you no, know, just get out of the way. I want to go in there. I want to get some Pokeballs. I want to get my TM. I want to name my Pokemon. I want to do all that stuff. And you're just distracting me, Mustard. 
And this is why I don't like mustard. Not because it just not just because it tastes horrible. Seriously, the taste of mustard is just disgusting. But because in video games, mustard does nothing but distract me. This Pokemon seems to be rather happy. I'm sh it, it better be happy. It, it's going to be a... I don't know what I'm going to name it. I don't want to name it Mountain Dew. This Pokemon has to have its own identity. It can't just be known as the sequel to Mountain Dew because it, what if it doesn't live up to the hype? It's got to be its own Pokemon. And I'm going to go with... Uh, we're going to name this Mountain Dew... I don't know. Yeah, I, I don't know why. I'm gonna name him Moss. Yeah, Moss. Because he's a tree, and trees get moss. Get it? I get it. Alright. But, okay, yeah, we Oak's... Er, he's not Oak. I keep calling him Oak. Professor Rowan is, an, is amazed by how amazing we are, which is so nice of him because I'm amazed by how amazing we are. Can't lie. Now he's gonna ask us to uh, fill out his Pokedex or whatever because... That's all the... He's just using us. He's like, oh, I'm going to secretly pretend that I'm going to be nice and give them a Pokemon. Then I'm going to shove my book in their face and force them to complete it because for some reason, I've been alive for 110 years and I still can't manage to do that. Because for some reason, I've been alive for 110 years and I haven't even got one Pokemon recorded in this stupid book. So I'm going to get a bunch of kids. To when you walked up to Route 201 with your Pokemon, what did you feel? I've lived for 60 long years. Even now, I get a thrill when I'm with a Pokemon. Now you should know what there are countless Pokemon in this world. I mean, there are just as many thrills waiting for you out there. Now go on. Catch up your grand adventure begins right now. This Pokemon I met... Okay, good. Just shut up. Shut up. I just want a Pokemon. And you're not giving me one. It is just so... Oh, wait, I already have a Pokemon. Never mind. Never mind. Okay, um... Scratch that. Okay. So, uh, let's get out here, and he, Rowan's gonna run out, and he's gonna be like, catch up, wait, I secretly love you, and I'm gonna give you this TM, which isn't really TM, it's something I put out of my pocket. <laughs> no, that, that's, that's, that's disgusting. I'll remind, yes, we know how return works, we know how TMs work, in case you haven't noticed, this is like my 20th Nuzlocke now. Oh, wow, I didn't know what Professor TMs, he was a trainer when he was young. Okay, catch up Alec as your mentor. I'm a bit more experienced than you as a trainer and a professor's assistant. Okay, follow me. Okay, you know what? She's going to go teach us how to catch a Pokemon, and I'm not going to have any of that because it's absolutely boring. So, so I was just going to skip all this magical stuff, go back to our home, you know, talk to our mom and all that. Then I realized on the way back, we kind of got to go through Route 201. So, yeah, we're going to do that and hope and pray we don't run into any wild Pokemon yet because... I, I need Pokemans, and I, I need Pokeballs. So here we go. Got to test our luck and see if we can get through it. And first patch down. All right, let's get over to the second one. Cross our fingers. You guys are probably hoping I do run into wild Pokemon, because you guys are just kind of mean like that. Here we go. And no. Ah. And it's it's a Glamio. Okay. I don't know if you can normally catch this here. Actually, I don't think you can. Maybe you can. I actually have no idea if you can normally get a Glammy out here. But uh, either way, we need to kill this thing. And luckily the speed the speed button works fine like in battle. Like outside of battle it is like completely broken. But inside of battle it seems to work just fine. So we have that to look forward to. Alright, well Route 201, we're not getting anything there. That's that's just a major disappointment. And okay, now Dawn's gonna teach us how to get a Pokemon and yeah, well, you know what? No, no she isn't. Even with the speed button, that took forever. I can't imagine how I can't imagine how slow it is on a DS. Although, as you know, I've played it on a DS before. Anyways, we have Pokeballs now, which means it's it's time to catch our very first Pokemon, and we're gonna do it right here on Route 202. So, do I need to heal up first? That's right. I, I was pressing start. I'm used to fire at Omega. Uh, we don't need to heal up. Let's let's live life on the edge. All right, let's get a Pokemon. Any day now, any Pokemon just want to pop out and, and join our party? It's going to be a... <sighs> it's a level 2 Kadabra. I really hope you don't know Teleport, because... That would be... That would be depressing. Kinesis! Okay, you know what? I'll take that. I don't actually know what Kinesis does. I think I'll find out in a second. 
It's it lowers something. It it my it lowers my accuracy. That's fine. I was just gonna throw a Pokeball, and you can't lower that accuracy. That how horrible would that be if a Pokemon can lower a Pokeball's accuracy? That would be just horrible. I, w I would be very upset like by that. All right, so we cut our very first Pokemon, which is a Kadabra, the Psychic type, and uh, unfortunately he only evolves by trade, but uh, we can change that eventually. I think. Uh, Normally, Abra evolves at like level 20 or something like that. So, if Kadabra gets to like 36, I think this is how it is in Fire Red Omega. When it gets to 36, I can use Pokegen to evolve it into an Alakazam. Just pretend that it evolved naturally. But not until it gets to a high enough level. What level it is, I haven't completely decided on yet. But I'm going to nickname this thing Fork because he's. It just happened. Uh, oh, you guys can't see, but I, I keep pressing a button on. Uh, and like Dezume, the bottom screen just like disappears. I don't know what button I'm pressing, but it's making me very sad when it happens. So that is our Pokemon for this fruit. Let's go heal up because he's going to be all all beaten and battered. And oh, we got to go look at his moves, see if he has anything useful. Although considering what the first gym is, he's not going to be that useful. He will be useful in the... I think the third gym is the ghost one or the fighting type one. I don't remember. Why did I come to the Pokemon? I don't know. Let's get some Pokeballs. Let's get maybe... I want to get 10. And then get that Premier Ball. The Premier Epicness. You also get a Premier Ball as a bonus. Yeah, I do. That, that's right. And we'll spend the rest on potions. Because that's just how things work in the Poke world. And alright. Now let's go heal up our Pokemans. Because I'm sure they're not feeling too great after that horrible battle against each other. Because pretty much the only people they battled since they were healed up back at my mom's house so yeah or I guess it's technically my house too yay it's everyone's house just one big group house okay so our Pokemon are all healed up we can be all happy now let's take a look at that Kadabra of ours I keep pressing start it's annoying me because that's not the button you use in this game oh he does no teleport oh ha. I am very, very, very lucky he did not use Teleport, but he knows Confusion, which is awesome. Now, let's see his stats. Look at those stats. Oh my god, I don't think I've ever seen a more impressive Pokemon. Turtwig, or Moss, you have to work on your special attack, though. Jeez. And your speed, wow. Well, that that is our Pokemon party right now, and uh, next time we'll be reaching... Um, I don't know what the next town is called. I don't know the Sinnoh region that well, to be honest. But uh, we'll be reaching there, and I believe we have a rival battle coming up. So that'll be next time on Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke Run. Still not as long as Emerald's title. Until next time, I'm Artie Tech Yo-Yo. Peace!